fun. What are you doing? Are you ready yet? Yeah, Dad, I'm coming. I just can't find no shoes to wear, man. You can't find no shoes to wear? What you calling them right now? Dad, I can't wear these. What, they too small or something? No, Dad, look at them. Are you even looking at them? I, I'm looking at them. What's wrong with them? <laughs> they dirty. Do you not see that? Look at, look at, look at the dirt on them. They shoes, son. They go on your feet to go outside. They're not going to stay clean. Dad, I'm not wearing these, man. I'm, I'm not wearing them, man. Just pick another pair. Which ones, Dad? They all dirty. <laughs> which one, Which ones can I wear? Any ones. It don't matter. Just pick a pair. Man, see, you too old to understand, like. <laughs> Why, beat you? Son, what about the red ones? What's wrong with them? The red? These? These old things? The ones I wore yesterday? You mean the ones I bought you last week? Dad, that's not the point. Nobody in the streets are wearing those. What? Where your ain't on the street. Yeah. Like I said, you just, you don't understand. You don't understand. That's it. You, you know what, son? You know what? Maybe you're right. Maybe you're right. Maybe I don't understand. I don't understand. You got dozens of, of, of nice shoes sitting here and you can't even pick. What about the, the gray ones got sparkles on them? What's wrong with them? Son, back in the day, Dad, please. Back in the day, I wore the same shoes from middle school all the way to high school. My shoe, matter of fact, my shoes were so messed up they were talking to each other, not from the front, from the side. One of them say hello, the other say goodbye. My shoes were tore up. You got more shoes this month than I got my entire childhood. Okay, Dad, but that's, that's not even the same thing. Like y'all were broke, we got like a little bit of money, so I mean, we <laughs> unless you paying the bill, we ain't got shit. Got money, yo is broke. All right, Dad. No, no, no. I'm just amazed. Some kids ain't even got no shoes. No, no. Some kids ain't got no feet. Yet you can still find room to complain. And I'm not understanding. Dad, I'm not complaining. I'm just saying, do you really want me to wear like the same shoes outside? Like you want me to wear these outside? Like when it just rained yesterday? Like you want me to mess up the fabric? I'm not. I'm not complaining. I'm just trying to be responsible, you feel me? Responsible? He, he won't be responsible. You won't be responsible, huh? I tell you what, how about this? How about from now on, you be responsible of buying your own sh**? How about that? Dad, I'm taking every last one of these pairs of shoes to the Goodwill, and hopefully someone with a little more grateful ability will get them and get more use out of them than you did. Wait a minute, Dad, you can't do that. I can't. Yeah, you said, you said you want to be more responsible, didn't you? Well, I tell you what, you're going to be responsible. You're going to be responsible for buying your own shoes, your own clothes, your own food, your own everything. Matter of fact, Man. rent is due on the first. If you got it, we'll be due. If you don't, you're getting out. Understood? You want to be more responsible. Kids out here starving, ain't got no clothes, ain't got no shoes, ain't got no food. But you can't pick a pair of shoes, do it, because they got dirt on them. Okay, I'll show you some dirt. I'll show you some dirt. I'll tell you what. No, you ain't got nothing else to worry about. You wanna know why? Cause you ain't gotta decide which shoes to wear cause they're too dirty and got some stains on them. You ain't gotta worry about it, you wanna know why? Cause the kids at Google are gonna get them. He really just took all my shoes. Well nowadays these kids so ungrateful don't make no sense. The Google will see how you go. Keep me for myself right here. So I just want to talk to you guys for a minute, right? So my room is a little dirty. I'm just filming the video. I got to clean up a little bit. But so this video was inspired by my little brother, right? So this is what happened. I'm going to just tell you a little story. So I woke up to my mom and my brother. They was not arguing, but they was having like a little back and forth because she was trying to get him ready to go to school. He got to go to school. Though. He's in high school. So I walk in there because I'm like, dang, what's going on? I'm trying to sleep. I got to wake up now. Let me see what's going on. So I walk in there and my brother is basically upset because he says, because he says he ain't got no shoes to wear. Now I went into his room. He has like 24, 25 boxes of shoes, probably more than I do. And he's like, I can't wear none of them because they did this and that. And I'm like, what's wrong with them? And he's like, oh, they dirty. They got scratches. They got this, this and that. And I'm looking at him like, are you serious? 
Like, I don't think he understood. Like, when I was in high school, I remember I wore this pair of Levi's. I wore this pair of Levi's for, like, the entire junior year. <laughs> like, because I didn't really have no more shoes like that. And so, I was just looking like, he not gonna wear these because they got scratches on them. So, I'm thinking to myself, oh my, and he's making, like, a real big, real big deal. I'm telling him, like, yo, it don't even matter. You just going to school. Ain't nobody looking at your feet like that. Like, just put some shoes on. He's like, no, it's not. Y'all don't understand. Blah, blah, blah. He must think we just balling out of control or privileged. To where, if a shoe get a little piece of dust on it, we could just go buy a new one, a new pair. And I'm just like, uh, I don't, I don't think you got the right family, brother. I'm at this point, I'm, I'm just, I'm, I'm amazed. I'm like, are you serious? Like, this don't even make no sense. So I go into my room and I get a pair of my shoes. And I'm like, all right. So if I gave you these shoes, would you wear them to school? I'm gonna show you what the shoes look like. These are the shoes right here. This is the exact one. I said, okay, if I gave you these to wear to school, would you wear? Them? I was, I showed them. These the shoes right here. This the shoe. This look, it's, it's not, it's not that bad. It got a few scratches on it, but it's not that bad. And he, so I'm like, look at him. Would you wear these? And he was like, look at him. Look at him. You're not gonna wear them because they got that. You're not gonna wear them because of a few little scuff marks. I'm like, boy, do you don't even know. But hold up, let me try to find them shoes. Hold up, wait a minute. Let me show you something. If I can find them, boy, y'all, y'all gonna be in look. Look at these shoes. Now these, these, these ain't even beat up. Wait a minute. I can't find another one right now, but I had some shoes that was a lot more beat up than that, and I wore them to school. So I don't even want to like. I was just so amazed by the fact that like, and I don't know if it's like all oh, maybe high school kids now. When I was in high school, of course they used to roast about shoes and stuff like that, whether you had on the newest Jordans or the newest this, newest that. I wasn't a part of that. Why? Because I couldn't afford no shoes like that, and I wasn't from the front like I could buy no fake Jordans. I don't want to none of that. I just wore what I had. You know what I mean? Because it was what I had, so I ain't gonna complain about it. But like I said, I was just amazed at the fact. That he wouldn't wear the shoes because they were like a little scratched up. And my whole thing to you guys, and the whole point of this video is to say like, it really is a lot of kids out here, a lot of people who don't have shoes at all. Who have like maybe one pair of shoes or maybe don't even have shoes. And there are people with no feet. So I mean like, <laughs> just the fact that like, a lot, of, and I feel like a lot of people are self-conscious about like the way that they dress and like the stuff that they wear. And really the truth is, nobody cares what you have on. And I'm just being completely honest with you. Nobody really cares. You can go out here and buy a thousand dollar pair of shoes, whether it be Yeezys or Balenciagas or Louis V. And people are going to look at them and they're going to be like, oh, okay. But ain't nobody going to come up and hand you no trophy. Ain't nobody going to look at him and say, oh, he got money. And like, ain't, no, ain't nobody paying attention to none of that. Like, it don't matter what you, like, look, my whole catalog, my whole thing is shoes, look, my Reebok. My Reebok is dirty. I wear these on a regular. I ain't wash these things in I don't know how long. My white shoes ain't even really white no more. They're like kind of cream. Like, I just, I wear them because, they, first of all, they're comfortable. And second, it's the shoes I got. It, they just shoes. Don't nobody care. Like, I did a video a while ago saying how I wore FUBU's to high school one time. And I talked about when I got to college, didn't nobody care about shoes? Like, it was like, okay, I got to college and like, the, I remember the first person I saw when I walked through the building was like a dude that had on some sketcher flip-flops or something. And I'm like, shoot, these dudes don't care. What, like, you come in here to get education, you come in, like, nobody looks at you that wrong and nobody is like that important to where you need to break the bank to get a new pair of shoes because they got dirt and scratches on them like what and so i was just real confused i was like man i gotta make a video about this of course i wanted to make it a joking thing first but it's a serious thing to say like if you're self-conscious about what you wear how you look whatever like understand that nobody's paying attention to that stuff but you and i want you to think about the fact that like you buying all these shoes or all these trying to get this new stuff to impress people who don't know you probably not even looking at you and ain't thinking about you it just don't make no sense and i'm like i'm i'm too old for that I'm 21 years old, I'm too old for that. I don't, I don't care nothing about, you know what I mean, what kind of shoe, whether they be Sketch or Jordan. The black shoes I just showed you were like Old Navy, non-name brand, ain't no ain't no stamp on the back, them wanting Vans. It don't even matter. I got a few shoes like that. It don't matter. And I just want y'all to like understand that. So that was the whole purpose. Blah, blah, blah. That was the whole purpose of this video was just to tell you guys like nobody cares, man. If 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 you like the the kid I was portraying in this video. Nobody cares. So get over it. Nobody cares what you're wearing. Nobody cares what you're doing. So just just get over it, bro. It's not that important. It's not that big a deal. They got a few scratches on them. Wear them anyway or donate them. You gonna buy some new ones, waste your money, go ahead. But I'm gonna spend my money on more important things like cameras and tripods and stuff like that. So it's a difference. But anyway, that's all I wanted to say. That was the purpose of this video. Um, I think I got an outro. So let's go ahead and get to that. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed that video. If you did, make sure to give it a like. That's a thumbs up. Also, make sure to comment below and tell me what you thought about it. Also, if you enjoyed it and you want to see more, might as well go ahead and subscribe. I post videos like this every single week, twice a week, as a matter of fact. Now, so make sure you come back and see me if you want to see some more funny videos. If you want to follow me on social media, all of my links are to the side over here and they're also in the description box below. So please, this one is bright. So please make sure to come back and see me. I appreciate you guys again for watching. Uh, 
I think that's all I got to say. Tap the notification bell to know when I post videos. And uh, I'm out.